Here is an extension to the previous question which we solved. The question is, we need to find point of intersection of normal with the graph. And in the last video, we had an example where we, saw, we found the equation of normal to the graph. Well, the question here is, the normal to the function 1 over x minus 1 at 2 comma 1 intersects the graph of f of x at another point. What are the coordinates of the other point? So that is the question, right? So we will first find equation of the normal as we did earlier. And then with that equation, we'll find point of intersection of normal with the function, right? So the function given to us is f of x equals to 1 over x minus 1, which I can write as x to the power of x minus 1 to the power of minus 1. And we can use power rule to find the derivative. Now, in this particular video, we'll not use the power rule. We will use the quotient rule and find the derivative. So the derivative of the function at any point x is, we'll use the quotient rule. That means denominator x minus 1 whole square. And the numerator is 1. So derivative of 1 is 0. So we get 0 times this function, which is 0. Negative derivative of this function, which is 1, right? Times 1. So that is what we get here. And that is indeed minus 1 over x minus 1 whole square, right? So as you see, the derivative is always negative for this function. Now we need to find derivative at x equals to 2. So f dash of 2 is equals to, we'll plug in 2 here, minus 1 over 2 minus 1 whole square, and that gives us a value of minus 1. So that also indicates slope of tangent at 2 for the function. Well, we are interested in finding slope of normal. Slope of normal will be, let's say m, will be perpendicular. So the slope of normal is going to be negative reciprocal of minus 1, which is going to be 1. Now we need to find equation of the normal with slope of positive 1 and going through the point which is 2 comma 1. So equation of this line can be written in the form of y equals to mx plus b, right? Now in this equation, we can write y, m, and x and get the value of b. Now let's solve it. So we have y equals to mx plus b. The value of y is 1. m is 1, slope which we found here. x is 2, so we'll write 2 in the brackets plus b, right? So that gives us 1 minus 2 equals to b, or b is equals to minus 1, correct? So since b is minus 1, we can now write down the equation of our line, which is y equals to, slope is 1, x minus 1. So y equals to x minus 1 is actually normal to the given functions. So that is the equation of normal. So normal to f of x. Now, what we need to find is, that this normal intersects the graph of f of x at another point. What are the coordinates of the other point? So whichever point it intersects, at that point the value of the function and this normal should be same, right? So at that point f of x should be equals to y, this value of y. So we'll solve this equation and find point of intersection, right? So the point of intersection will be x minus 1 equals to 1 over x minus 1. Now we can cross multiply and solve for x. We have x minus 1 whole square equals to 1. Now that is to say we'll expand this which is x square minus 2x plus 1 equals to 1, right? Now this can be solved. We'll take 1 on this side so we get x square minus 2x which can be factored as x x minus 2 equals to 0, right? Now this equation is satisfied only at two points, which is x equals to 0 and at x equals to 2. We already know that the normal is at 2, so the other point is x equals to 0, correct? So when x is equals to 0, what is the y point? y point will be equals to, we can plug in the value here or there, getting the same value. So at x equals to 0, we know y equals to 0 minus 1, that is minus 1. Correct? And in this case, we know if I plug in 2 here, 2 minus 1 is 1. So in that case, y is equals to 1. Therefore, what are the coordinates of the other point? 
Our answer is coordinates of the other point are 0 and minus 1. Correct? So that is how you can find the coordinates of the other point. So let's go through this once again. So what we did really was that first we found the equation of the normal by finding derivative of this function at x equals to 2. So derivative was minus 2. Normal is perpendicular to the tangent and derivative which we find is actually slope of the tangent. So normal slope will be negative reciprocal of minus 1. So we got our slope of normal which was this, right? So slope of normal that is for normal and the point. By using y equals to mx plus b with slope of 1 and point 2, 1, we got equation of our normal. So that is the equation of our normal. Do you see that? y equals to x minus 1 is the equation of the normal. Then we find point of intersection, right? Point of intersection between the normal and the graph by equating their y values. We solve the equation, got two values for x, x equals to 0 and x equals to 2. 2 is the point which we have already considered. So the new point or the other point is 0 minus 1. So that is our answer. I hope you appreciate the way it was done. And this is really a very important question from test point of view. Have a good look at it. And then do similar questions. Thank you and all the best.